Welcome back to CLE Weekend. So tomorrow it is National Tea Day, and we thought what better place to come than the Tea Lab in Lakewood. Now listen, I am not a coffee drinker, so tea's kind of my only option, and I love it, and I love places like this. I'm with the owner, Carlos Ramos, right now, and let me tell you, this place is beautiful. Oh, thank you. You can see behind all the colors. I mean, you walk in and you feel how inviting it is. Tell us a little bit about what the Tea Lab is. Well, the Tea Lab is the largest purveyor of loose leaf teas in Cleveland. So uh, we try to have teas from all over the world. Uh, we have different types of tea from orthodox to flavored to fun flavors to very, uh, very distinct, high up on a mountain kind of teas. <laughs> but what one of the things that we do with the color and the way the store is set up, we want everybody to feel welcome. So it's not too foo-foo, it's not too ornate, it's just everybody comes in, they feel relaxed, they they can either uh, pick out teas to take home or we can make a cup of tea for everybody. Um, and you know, we use reverse osmosis water so the tea is probably the best you're gonna get. Um, but we carry all the tea accessories that everybody uh, would need. And I don't know if you know this, but tea is the most drunk beverage in the world. More oh. than coffee, uh, not as much as water. So, wow, but, uh, I didn't know that. You, you learned see? something new from the yeah. expert Everybody's here. Everybody's <laughs> used to a coffee shop on every corner, so we have this corner to ourselves. Yeah, now your corner is really quite special because when you come in, the staff that you have, and you are so knowledgeable, right? Because I walked in and you're like, well, let's start. Tell me, what do you like? And I'm like, well, I think I like fruity. But then you had me smelling different ones. And I love how the concept here works, right? Mm -hmm. So I'm wondering, I, I still got some questions to ask you, but do you think we could kind of start and you could walk me through, just make a tea for me? Because doing a loose leaf tea is much different than like grabbing a bag and just dropping oh, it Oh yeah, in. and one of the things that that you get with a tea bag compared to us, yeah. you get the full tea leaf. So after a while, those tea leaves get beat up and then you just get these little specks of tea leaf, which adds to astringency, where you're gonna get a much smoother and more uh, robust flavor from any of the teas. Yeah, that's so, what we want, especially in the morning like this yeah. now. So I'm not looking for a nighttime tea. I told you, I do like kind of a fruitier yeah. flavor. So. You think you can pick one out for me? Yeah, there? I think we have one. I know you like uh, fruity, so this is a rooibos uh, blend. Ooh. It's uh, passion uh, fruit with grapefruit. Uh -huh. uh, so, like and rooibos is caffeine free, but they, it comes from Africa and they drink it all the time because all the vitamins that you get with the rooibos. Uh -huh. So let's uh, do it. So now we have two kettles that are preset to different temperatures. Different teas need different temperatures. Okay. So uh, we have one that's set for black teas and herbals and one for green teas and white teas. So a little bit more delicate. So good. So, mm. and then okay. what we do is also one of the things that's key about uh, making a cup of tea is you kind of want to measure it out and you don't want too much tea. You don't want, you just want the right amount. Yeah. So we usually recommend one teaspoon for every eight ounces of water. Good to know, one um, teaspoon for every eight ounces of water. And then one thing that people tend to forget is, or they've been taught that you boil the water. Boiling water, whether it's tea or coffee, is not a good thing. Cause you singe the flavor. Oh. So, um, I love on some of these bins, there's like this great little sticker that says a tea lab, and those are ones that you guys, yes. your own creation. But do you have different ones then, clearly, for the different seasons? Oh yeah, right. we have we have a whole, we have a whole line of holiday teas. We just made uh, a special blend that we sold out of for the eclipse. Mm. Uh, sometimes inspiration comes from anywhere, so it's like uh, we just made a spice tea for the movie Doom that came out. Oh, that's so, fun. Yeah, so sometimes we get different inspirations. Yeah. Sometimes we get uh, people asking us for blends that offer certain health benefits. For example, we made one Lumina's Nectar. It's a lactation tea, so uh, which a lot of people have a hard time finding. And our goal was not only to make it for health benefits, but something that tastes good. Yeah, and this yeah, one that's tastes. Key. <laughs> oh yeah, no one wants to drink medicine. Yeah, no. So, but that one tastes like uh, spiced apple cider. Oh, so. I love it. You know, while you're doing this and getting this ready, I thought maybe we could take a walk because I did see these cool like packages that you have. 
of different maybe remedies for different things if you're feeling a little sick or have a sore throat. So do you mind if we uh, take a walk? No, and absolutely. Look around? Great, let's do that. Okay, so I've got my, what is it again? Passion grapefruit. Mm. It's a ribose-based tea, so there's no caffeine but a lot of vitamins. Oh, it is so good and a lot of good flavor. I mean, yes. I taste it all. Now, speaking of making iced teas, hot teas, whatever it would be, if I'm doing this at home, you've got so many accessories. Exactly. And these caught my eye. What are these? These are great. Any of our mugs are designed to eliminate a teapot. So it gives you space and it's very functional. These are great for the office or if you have a small kitchen. We also have iced tea accessories up there, but we try to cater to people's needs, yeah. not just selling teapots and all that, which we do carry. Yeah, so. you carry so much stuff. One of the things that caught my eye when I walked in was this, anti-cold. The Tea Lab, you make this right here. Yes, we were kind of creative and we had a lot of herbs in the back and we said, let's make something for a cold. And it turned out that what we did was great because Customer feedback was it helps with the cold, it shortens the duration of the cold, yeah. it even helps with allergies and sinuses. Mm, that's the time of year that we're in right now. I exactly. love that. You have so many options too. The gift baskets too, another thing for the tea lover, your family, your friends. Um, if we want to come in, whether we want to buy something for ourselves or something for someone else, what's the best place to get more information? Uh, actually, our website, tlabcle.com, or just give us a call at 216-712-4410. We have a great staff. They're, they're willing to answer any question, and there's no such thing as a stupid question. You know, we, we're here to help educate and help people when they come in and uh, just try to decipher all these teas that are available. Well, come on in, like me, with my passion grapefruit. Yep. Okay, and you can enjoy yourself here in Lakewood at the Tea Lab. Thanks so much, Carlos. Thank you, Jamie. All right, we'll be right back on CLE Weekend. I'm gonna enjoy more of this. <laughs>